Well, we, we are also, uh, I've done a little indie music festival for years called the Outlaw Roadshow, and a bunch of us uh, spun off from it this year, and we're starting a new one called the Underwater Sunshine Festival, which will be this fall in New York uh, at the first night, the first uh, few days will be at Bowery Electric this year nice. again, like where we, we did the last one. Uh, and so I've been listening to a lot of bands to book on that, um, and there were two women in the last week that really knocked me out with their records. One was uh, Michaela Davis, okay. who's from upstate Rochester, and I was looking at a video of hers, an auto, audio tree uh, performance. She's playing a, a full-size upright harp. I, I, it might not be a full concert size, but it's a, it's a harp. Her guitar player is bowing it like the guy from Sigur Ross, and her drummer is playing drums and then switches over to like playing xylophone with the drums at the same time. It's pretty incredible sound and performance. She's a great writer. She really knocked me out. And then there's a woman named Caroline Rose who just released a new record called Loner. Uh, I think it's on New West. I don't know. It's just in the last okay. month or so. It's a brilliant record. It's like, it reminds me a lot of the great albums that people wrote in the in new wave artists in the mid eighties. It's got a lot of humor to it, uh, but it's a pretty biting humor. Mm -hmm. Um, and it's just a really interesting set of songs from a woman's perspective, growing up, you know, living in a metropolitan life as a woman and a musician nowadays. I think she's pretty incredible. Um, that record, Loner, is an unbelievable record. I, I would recommend it to anybody. Those two really knocked me out this week. Awesome. Um, and I, did a, I just did some background vocals for my friend Sean Barna uh, for his record, which is going to be called Sissy, which is coming out hopefully by the time we play it on the podcast in a month or two. Nice. Um, but those have been what I've been like focused on the last week or so.